Hey everybody, it's Gay Boy Oz, and today's video I actually wanted to go ahead and talk about the Doll Zone body, the B27 005 body, which is a YoSD body. Um, as you can see right now, I have uh, my Yo Carter on it, and this is the one that he came with. Uh, please excuse the blanket backdrop, it's because um, since he's white skin and um, it's hard to really get a lot of detail if he's not um, in front of something that's going to, um, you know, pretty much show um, his resin color. And um, also, I have my window closed because my window is like pretty much one, one fourth of my wall. So it pretty much lights up my whole entire room. And um, since there's a lot of light in my room... The reflection of the white resin is pretty um it's pretty bad so you don't really get to see a lot so before i start i i don't know if you guys have noticed but he's a little pigeon toed and that's not because of posing that's more because the shoe the shoe it's glued weird so um it kind of pushes one of his feet a little like uh at an angle it like you know at an angle like at a weird angle, so I have to pigeon toe him to get him to stand in his shoes. Um, I'm gonna have to buy him uh, different shoes later on along the line. As of right now, I don't really mind the whole pigeon toe thing, but again, th like I said, that's the shoe. So I'm gonna go ahead and undress. Oh, before I continue, I know the whole idea of a, a saggy uh, sleeve was a cute idea for the jacket, um, but it's starting to get on my nerves now. <laughs> So yeah, so let me go ahead and undress him so we could get this uh, body re uh, body video uh, uh, started. Now, like I said, um, you see this shoe, this one is the one that's like at an angle. So you try to straighten it and it won't. This one is fine. So, and you can still see the glue on it, which I think it's a little shoddy of Doll Zone to do that. I don't know. I've never received anything from them that wasn't like good quality but I, you know I guess they're allowed to mess up once in a while yeah I mean I love doll zone don't get me wrong um eh shoo oh god poor guy I'm gonna have to stand him on his head there we go yay okay so we got that we get his little Just gonna have to tie it back later. There we go. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, so let me get these little socks off. And um, again, like I said, um, I don't have a problem with Doll Zone. I really love them. I have like ma the majority of my dolls are Doll Zone. And um, the first doll I ever fell in love with was the Doll Zone uh, Joe, which. By the way, I don't see a lot of, which is really sad, but yeah. Okay, so there we go. So this is the body. As you can see, it's pretty... Actually, you know what? It looks like their, um, S their MSD body. Um, the It just looks a little more chunky, but it does look a lot like a miniature version of their... Of their, um, their what is it? The O9? 009 yeah kind of looks like that now i really even though it's a yo sd i don't know if you guys could see that focus 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 but the feet are actually really really cute uh, for being small stature they're very they're um sculpted good also jesus louise look at these hands tell me these hands are not Wait, hold on focus Oh, look at these hands. They're really cute. Uh, I have not seen hands for a uh, YoSD. They're like this. This cute. Look at that. Normally they have like webbing from the resin. Focus. Focus. No focus. Stupid. I'm, I'm sorry. It's not focusing very well. There we go. Uh, maybe if I stun them on this. There we go. See, these hands are really nice. 
Now, posability wise, um, he's really good at holding his poses. Now, I haven't restrung him. I haven't, um, I haven't swayed him or anything like that. He's able to stand on one leg. I wish I could show you guys, but like I said, I have a, a blanket backdrop, so um, you guys are able to see without the lighting. Now, he's double jointed, so he can um, he can go ahead and put his hands up and close his face, which is always good. Um, he's also double jointed in his legs, so he could do that. So he could do the whole sitting on your on, on his legs. The range from his feet are also very good. Um, also, I like that they have uh, mobility joints, as you can see. They also, so they can do this. Wait. Again, he's not suaded. So see, he has that. Um, it doesn't have a groove. Normally, they would have a groove, but I think the whole fact that it, um, the resin, the, the, the hole, it, sturdies the leg so he's able to do that she later kick so that's good um let's see has a groove right here to hold the um to hold it has a groove right here to hold the leg like that um like i said it has mobility joints which is good because sometimes it's easier just to move the leg than to move the whole thing and it um you know it blocks the <sighs> It blocks the thigh from actually going all the way, but the mobility joints is good. I like that. Um, for the slouching, it has a little uh, resin bump, so it could hold it there. And it has a good. Give me a second. It has a good back slouch. Has a good front slouch as well. Well, the front slouch not so much. But it's it's there. Let's see. Let's see. So the body itself is with a head it's twenty nine centimeters. And without a head it's twenty three point five centimeters. Now, if you wanna go ahead and get this body and you wanna hybrid it hy hybrid it, the neck length is five centimeters. So, you know, that's always good. Um, let's see. What else? Oh, you know what? Something that I noticed, not, uh, not only when I got my doll, but before I got it, I noticed this. I don't know if you could see that. If, like, right here, it has the, um, an R for right side, which is very common for dolls to have that on the peanuts, on the joints. See, like this one? Sorry, does not focus. See, this one has it right here. Actually, no, that doesn't have it there. That's just resin bubble. But see, it doesn't have it on this one, but it has it on this one. And that kind of bothers me a little because when he's sitting down or whatever and his knee, ex knee um, peanut is exposed, you see the R right there. I mean, I think it would have been better if they would have just put it on the side of the peanut and not on the very top bottom part where you could see it. Um, other than that, I actually like this body. It's it's a cute body. It's really cute. I don't know. I like it. I like the proportions. It's a little taller than my other MSD. My, I'm sorry, my other USD. Um, other than that, it's very good. I, I mean, I ha I'm not a, a USD person. So, um, my interaction with them is pretty limited, I would say. I have, I, I have one, which is a Sum, uh, uh, Teeny Gem? Tiny Gem? Little Gem. I don't, I'm not sure. Hmm. But, um, yeah, and their bodies are a little chunky. So, um, their range is not as much as this one. And the, um, the proportions are a little more chibi, which are a little more chubby. And, um... Yeah, so they're not 100% like super like flexible or posable or, or whatever, you know, but other than that, I mean, like I said, I really like this body. It's very good. I know they have a girl version of this body as well. Um, other than that, um, 
yeah, if you have any questions about it, go ahead and um, send me a message, post a comment, um, you know, um, and I'll go ahead and try to um, answer your questions or do a follow-up video in case you guys uh, want a certain pose to see if it holds it or anything like that. Um, once again, thank you for watching and have a good day.